Greetings to everyone out there and welcome back to Around the Clock. Alright everybody, with Sonic Cross Shadow Generations being recently announced, some brand new story details have surfaced that reportedly confirms that Maria will be a part of this game. This info comes from the official description page for Sonic Cross Shadow Generations on Steam and in the About This Game section it states this, Shadow the Hedgehog is back and teaming up with classic and modern Sonic in Sonic Cross Shadow Generations, an all new collection featuring two unique experiences. Play as Shadow the Hedgehog in a brand new story campaign featuring never before seen powers and abilities. When Shadow's old nemesis Black Doom re-emerges and threatens to take over the world, Shadow must journey into his own past, confront painful memories, face familiar foes and unlock new powers to save the world and prove why he's known as the ultimate life form. Sonic Cross Shadow Generations also includes a complete remaster of the classic hit Sonic Generations featuring newly remastered versions of iconic 2D and 3D stages with upgraded visuals and bonus content. So there you all have it, it's plain as day. Right there in the description of the game it states that Shadow must journey into his own past, confront painful memories and face familiar foes. So really the huge painful memory that basically traumatized Shadow is the death of his friend Maria, so it will only make sense if Sega includes this storyline within Sonic Cross Shadow Generations, and that will really build on the story campaign for Shadow side of this game for him to confront that very painful memory, and they did say memories here, so there's probably some painful memories that we don't even know about and Sega will introduce them in this game because they also say here that you'll unlock new powers to save the world, so hey man, we'll see when this game comes out, but from that description there, I think it really confirms that Maria will be a part of this game and I cannot wait to see how Sega tells this story. So with that being said guys, that's going to do it for this video and what are your thoughts on everything discussed here? Please let me know down in the comment section and please make sure to like, share, and subscribe and as always remember to keep it locked here at Around the Clock where here we focus on Nintendo news content around the clock. I'll catch you guys in the next video.